by 2007, Entebbe International Airport had the capacity to handle about 80,000 people a day. As the nation prepared to host the Commonwealth Heads of Government meeting, Chogam, in the same year, the airport was renovated and expanded. However, by 2012, statistics show that passenger traffic surged to 1.2 million people per day. Since then, fresh expansion plans have been drawn, with the first phase launched by the President in August 2015. Today, the landslide expansion program was launched by the Transport and Works Minister, John Biabagambi. According to the project, the expansion is going to begin right from here, and then it will go through the first parking up to the second parking. The Ministry of Works and Transport has assured Ugandans that this is going to ease the departure and arrival of travelers. The space will be bigger. Okay? So it will be the passengers will not line up as they are lining up now. The upgrade will include bigger arrival and departure lounges, a new car park and a cargo terminal. The minister cautioned the contractor about efficiency in the project. And the people of Uganda, they expect quality work from the contractors and they will demand value for money. It's actually a one-of-a-kind project which needs careful planning, efficient working, such that the disruptions in the day-to-day -day operations of this airport are minimized as much as possible. Biabagambi said the upgrade will disrupt passenger traffic for a while, but not to a larger extent. Government plans to renovate more airports and airstrips across the country. Solomon Kawesa, NTV.